Looking good on that front, boy, we are tracking two storms now. One a hurricane, one going to be a hurricane. Actually, one still a major hurricane. It has been very slowly weakening, but it is Umberto, which is still a category four storm, made it all the way up to category five status. And you can see they're kind of they were paralleling earlier, but now you see Umberto is moving a little bit faster than Amelda is, so it'll pass its way up towards the north. So there it is moving to the northwest 13 miles an hour. It is expected to start to make Make that turn as we go throughout today into tomorrow while again still gradually weakening to a category three then a category two as we go throughout the day tomorrow but there is the proximity of Bermuda and we have a tropical storm watch in Bermuda due to this storm but that's going to be upgraded to a hurricane warning eventually that's going to be tomorrow as again we'll talk about Imelda here in just a second but look at it moving its way up and out but enough of an influence that is one of the factors that's steering Imelda behind it 60 mile per hour winds moving to the north a little slower at nine miles an hour and you can see again it is forecasted to become a hurricane look at your tropical storm warnings all in blue watch there in yellow and if you expand this out again there's Bermuda with that tropical storm watch but watch what happens with this system as we go throughout today into tomorrow expected to be a category one storm and again that will be upgraded to a hurricane warning because it is expected to become a category two storm as it moves its way over Bermuda throughout the day on Wednesday kind of late on Wednesday so you see that abrupt turn that of course is due to that stalled front high pressure to the north and Umberto off to its east so a lot of factors go into that one pulling its way out to see so minimal effects even for the east coast of Florida which again is good news.